Notice, this is the absolute last video where Melody Luna will be with the dolls. I do have a move out video in mind, so stay tuned for that. Enjoy. Okay Melody, we've brushed our teeth, we've read a story, and you have your bunny right there. Are you ready for me to turn out the lights? Yes I am Lou. I'm very tired, and I want some rest, or else I'll be cranky tomorrow. That's good Melody Luna. Now get some rest. Good night. So Melody Luna is now asleep. Is there anything you need help with Ox? Not really. But I would like it if you took the trash out and put the bins at the curb for trash pickup tomorrow morning. Alright. I'm on it. And it looks like the bag isn't too heavy this time. That looks just about right. Now I feel tired. I think I'll head off to bed now. Oh would you look at that. It's that noodle hair perfection doll that is fostering that crybaby Melody Luna. I do not feel bad at all that her parents got terminated, because they deserve it for raising such a spoiled brat like Melody. If only I could get my hands on her somehow, but how exactly? I've got the perfect scheme. I will wait for all of the ugly dolls to go to sleep, and then at around 2 in the morning, I will go in through that window up there and take that spoiled brat Melody Luna to the Alan Arceum's cave, then, me and my fellow colleagues could give her an extremely harsh punishment day like what we did to Violi. Now with Constance and Boris Johnson on the team, it will be nearly twice as fun. Now this part's going to be absolutely boring, and that's waiting until 2 a.m. to execute the plan. Does anyone have a cup of coffee I could drink to keep me up? You know what? I think it's time to snag that spoiled brat Melody Luna and take her with me. Now to think, what should I carry her in? I need to stuff her in something, so what will it be? Oh I knew it right off the bat. I will use this money bag that I was saving for to rob a bank with mask. But robbing the bank can wait, it's kidnapping time now. There. Now that I pushed Melody Luna into the bag, it's time for me to get out, what makes it better? I'm leaving her bunny behind. Ugh, I feel very weird. Something must be up with my bed. Wait, this isn't my bed. This is a cave. Why am I in a cave? That's right old chap. You have been sent to my lair, where your bratty butt will stay for the rest of your life. Oh my god. It's Alan Huntington. The leader of the Alanistiums. They turned Moxie and Lucky Bat into scary green creatures, and flushed Lou down the toilet at Moxie's present store. A Crimea River you brat. Besides, you don't deserve to live with the ugly dolls, because you're not even a doll, you're a human brat. Stop calling me a brat. I'm very scared right now. <laughs> you can cry all you want, but that won't change anything. Now, I'll check on you later. It's now 7.30 in the morning, so later, I'll invite my Alan Arceum friends to teach you a harsh and strict lesson on being a brat. You know, something feels very, very, weird. Normally I wake up with joy and happiness, but today is just confusing. I haven't seen Melody Luna either, so that scares me a bit. I'm going to go in her room and see if she's okay. Oh crap. I don't see Melody in her room. And what makes things even more suspicious? Her bunny is left here. Melody Luna always takes her bunny with her wherever she goes. 
I've got to tell Ox about this. Ox. This is very important. Is everything alright Mandy? I couldn't find Melody Luna in her room, and she left her toy bunny behind. I know she wouldn't leave us, because she feels uncomfortable away from us, that means our sweet Melody Luna has been kidnapped. She has been what? I need to pull out my tablet and check the security footage to see if what you're saying is true. Okay, everything seems to be going normal. She's fast asleep like an angel. Wait, is that who I think it is? And he seriously just threw Melody Luna into a bag? Oh my freaking gosh. Of all people, she was kidnapped by Alan Huntington, the worst troublemaker in all of beyond. The Alanis Diems has struck again. Now now Mandy, we can't just panic. Somebody's got to be brave enough to stand against Alan. And I think I know the only one that is brave enough to take on the task. Did I just hear that Melody Luna got kidnapped? I swear to God Docs and Mandy, I didn't do it this time. We know it wasn't you. It was the frickin' Alan Ostiums. The Alan Ostiums? Of all people, it was them? I'm afraid so. And you are the only one that's brave enough to take them down, so you have to do the doll family a massive, massive favor. Go into the Alan Ostiums's cave, rescue Melody Luna, beat the living crap out of Alan, and then call the police. Okay? You got it Ox. I will not, and I repeat, not, let anyone be taken into the hands of those monsters. Go get em old friend. Hey there Melody Luna. It's me, Lou. I'm here to bail you out of Alan's wrath. You are? That would be great. But how? The gate is sealed shut. Watch this Melody Luna, you'll get to see how tough I really am. You saved me Lou. That was the worst experience I've ever had. Even worse, I don't have my bunny beside me. It's alright Melody Luna. You're safe with me. I will never let anyone feel the Alanistium's wrath. Not today, not tomorrow, not ever. Alright, let's check in on Melody Luna. So you were the one to take Melody Luna away from me? Do you care to explain? Slow down old chap. What makes you think it was me? Look around. This is the cave of the Alanistiums. And you are the leader. The rest of the Alanistiums are grounded, so that only leaves you. Do you want to change your mind now? Oh wait, never mind, because look behind you. Ahem. Wait, Officer Peter? How did you find me here? Lou didn't even call the cops on me. Who did? It was a phone call from Manti Perfection. You make me sick, Alan. Hands behind your back right freaking now. Alan Huntington, I'm arresting you on suspicion of child abduction and child abuse. You do not have to say anything, but it may harm your defense if you do not mention one questioned, something which you later rely on in court. Anything you do say will be given in evidence. Take that you filthy hag. Have fun in jail, and enjoy a nice grounding while you're at it. Melody Luna and I will go home so she can reunite with her bunny, and then we are coming right to the jail cell to discipline you. Alan, what in the world makes you think that kidnapping little children is alright? You know darn well what's alright and what's not. Melody Luna is such a sweetheart, and I bet she was scared to death in the cave. What you did is clearly unforgivable, and now you're getting what's coming. That was the most traumatizing thing that I've ever been through. What could be worse than what you did? Nothing. That's it. You are grounded until Adam starts his third miniseries. And while you are grounded, you will be eating nothing but lumpy potatoes for every meal, including dessert. No fast food for you, only lumpy potatoes. I agree with everyone. Now go to your prison bed right now. And if you don't stop crying like a motor car, I will turn you into one, and you will be given away on the Beyond Price is Right.